Now in our tutorial on educational technology pedagogies, we're going to look at your self-study and how you're progressing and you should come along prepared to detail your successes and your failures. Part of what we're framing here is the learning community, being able to support your learning and how you are developing your self-study and your learning about ChatGTP. Now we'll also be looking at the various learning approaches and the different pedagogical approaches and using some of the different um, elements of that to explore those different concepts in more detail. But come along with the particular concepts that you're interested in that are supporting your learning and your learning about ChatGTP so that we can tease those out and explore those in more detail. Likewise, we'll be discussing your learning environment. The learning environment that you've been involved in in the past as a student, as an educator, as a teacher, or as an instructor, and also the learning environment you're currently involved in, and in particular the learning environment that's supporting your learning about ChatGTP for your self-study. And finally, of course, the learning community. The community that you're involved with in this course, communities that you're involved in outside of the course, and with your other learning experiences, but also how you build communities for your own students in the future. How you can frame the use of educational technologies to support community development. And we'll be discussing some more about that in the tutorial.